Now, let's send it over to Mackenzie Laporte, who introduces us to this week's Indigenous special guest. The pamphlet is already out, and this week for our Indigenous special guest, we have KU's Lori Hasselman, giving us details about what to look forward to at this year's powwow. This is Lori's first year here at KU, originating from the Shawnee and Delaware tribes of Oklahoma. I did in the past like volunteer at the powwow with some of the children's activities and some other things, and of course attended and ate fry bread, but other than that, this is kind of my first go run. Lori has experienced powwows back home with her people at Haskell and at KU. For me, it's always the grand entry. The grand entry is always really emotional and it just feels really good to be with, the, with your people. It's kind of like a family reunion in a lot of respects. Not only can folks look forward to the grand entry, but also a large assortment of events such as the Pow Wow 101 Workshop and Indian Education 101 with Alex Redcorn. Each educating the general public on the correct powwow etiquette, history, and terminology. And so in order to get to what's really important, you kind of have to sift through all those things first. KU alumni Robert Hicks Jr. will be screening his film, Relocation of Natsuki. Following Hicks is Dr. Tracena Milk, a former Haskell professor who has done extensive research on indigenous boarding schools share some of those moments with our allies and hopefully be able to um, connect with the greater Lawrence community, share in some of our culture, and hopefully provide a little bit of education and awareness around some of the issues that, that Indigenous people face. The public can enjoy all this and more on April 9th. Now let's send it back to Gabriel and Sarah. Thanks, Mackenzie. 